What's up, guys? It's your fucking boy. Welcome to part number 17 of GTA 5 for the Xbox Series X. What's going on, guys? Um, yeah, guys, so this is my fourth attempt at getting this shit straight. I hope and pray to fucking God that we're good. I'm tired of this. If this doesn't work right now, I'm just going to stop it and call it a day. But it should be good now. Um, that being said, um, so I'm going to talk about some channel news that I have. Um, so we spoke about the 1,000 subs on YouTube. Again, thank you for that. Shout out to you guys, the viewers. Uh, but we actually also hit another 100 over this week. So again, huge shout out to you guys. We're at 1,100 subscribers, guys. And like I said, nothing but the fucking moon after this one. I'm, I'm going to keep going and keep going strong. Um, other than that, what else do we got? So, like I said, guys, I promise you guys a vlog at 1,000 subs. It's uploaded. Go watch it. Like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. Um, and then we did the podcast. So, shout out to my guests that were there for the podcast. Shout out to everybody, the chat, all, all of that great stuff. It was quite the controversial one, guys. And I was talking about this, you know... In earlier parts where I fucking kept cutting out um I don't expect you guys to watch it entirely it's four and a half hours like who the fuck has that kind of time but if for some reason you have nothing better to watch and you have some time just go fucking watch it you know watch some of it today watch some of it later some watch some of it whenever the fuck you want um but it, this one was a little bit more controversial than the rest of them I know the first and the second one were just with the boys just drinking. This third one, we actually left it open to the chat. So there was topics being shot over to us by the chat. And you already know these fucking dudes behind their phones, they be going off. So, yeah, big shout out to the chat. Thank you guys for making the, the podcast easier on us with topics and that much more entertaining. But, yeah, guys, um, I got another podcast in the works right now. I'm going to verify with some of my homies, so I don't know when I'm going to get that one out, but it should be hopefully sometime this month, maybe next month. I haven't decided yet, but, um, but yeah, guys, other than that, I don't have any more channel news, so let's just hop right into it. Part number 17 of GTA 5 for the Xbox Series X. Let's fucking do it. Oh, Plex. I'm sorry, buddy. My shit just keeps crashing. I think I have, like, like uh, hardware issues or something. It's like, it's like it streams. But then my fucking screen right here goes black. Not even my my second display. It's like my actual laptop display. But I think I think we're good now. Um, yeah, so let's get right fucking into it. And yeah, guys, like I said, it's Faded Friday. I went over to uh, Aldi's and I found these uh, seltzers. And I actually already tried them. And I know I usually do, don't do any promotion. But these seltzers, guys, are literally the epitome of what I think a seltzer should be like. Again, I'm not sponsored. It sounds like a fucking sponsorship. No. Uh, f if you guys want me to prove to you that I'm not sponsored, fuck Vista Bay. Fuck all these. Fuck whoever made these. I don't fucking know you. I can care less. You can suck my dick. But <laughs> these are actually pretty good. I'm not going to lie. This is the epitome of what I believe a seltzer should taste like. It's not super sweet. And it's not super underwhelming like... Uh, white claws and, and some of these are it's called vista bay and they're pretty good it's like the perfect amount of whatever flavor it is so this one's tangerine and yeah guys it's like it's fucking spot on you know um oplex they kind of remind me of those uh walmart sodas from like 10 years ago that come in those big ass like plastic uh bottles um that have flavor they like had lime blackberry cherry i think they had grape I think they had lemon too. They had like a bunch of different flavors and it was just all clear. Do you remember those? No, not RCs. They're, um, fuck, bro. Like, I don't remember what they were called, but they, it was just a, a clean soda. It's, it's like a clean soda. It's a clear soda, but with hella flavor. But it's, it's not as sweet as, as those, but it's, these are pretty fucking good. So, cheers to you, Oplex. Again, I appreciate you, buddy, for uh, stopping by. And I'm being on the podcast. That was that was a fucking good one, man. For fuck, for damn sure. So, uh, but yeah, dude, perfect. Not super sweet. 
Not underwhelming. It's it's fucking good. Yes. Yeah. Is it? Was it those? No, I don't think it was those either. I mean, watch. I'm gonna look it up. I'm gonna look it up real quick. Walmart, clear, flavored soda, and it was like zero calorie everything. I don't know if it was this brand. But they were like these, bro. Like, it's this one. They, they think it's called like Clear America. These were pretty good. Yeah, strawberry was a good flavor. They had a black cherry, uh, orange, white grape. But yeah, it was just basically like their clear sodas and shit. They were pretty good. Kind of reminds me of these, but I still think these, the Walmart ones, are a little bit sweeter. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Well, they, yeah, they kind of taste like that, but not as sweet. Um, all right, but yeah, let's get right fucking into this, guys. I don't want to waste any more time. So I don't know how the fuck Trevor ended up here. He needs a fucking car. Well, there goes the... Yeah, I'm not driving towards that. Is there anybody on that boat? I don't know. Why doesn't Trevor... How did Trevor end up here? What the fuck? He's on an island. Um... What missions do I got? Oh, well, Trevor actually does have a mission. Marianne. Why is it blinking on Franklin's? Franklin, man, I'm following the architect. All right, don't fuck it up. All right. All right, right, we're right into it. Well, I don't have a fucking car. <laughs> oh my god. When the fuck did they put this song in this game? Yeah, thanks a lot. Site inspection. Architect on site. That guy's not even wearing his fucking PPE. Hey, hey. Building standards. Where's your hard hat? Where's yours, bitch? So what's up, Oplex? What are you doing right now, buddy? Those idiots drilled the new caissons on the west side. You're kidding me. The bedrock ends there. We need caissons on the east side. Ah, uh, no drama. It's a government contract. We'll be paid until completion. I ain't taking a fall for this screw up. It's a government contract. No one's taking a fall. Except the government. Oh shit. That guy's fucking gone. Just bought tri-tips and four racks of ribs to make to go to my oh, cousin's look. house tomorrow. Oh hell yeah! Study him and study him hard. What do you think about the fight? I mean, I know we kind of talked that's about it, I think, on the plan. pod. But what do you think about it? Text, remember? Yeah, that's it. This guy. Anyone know this guy? Hey, man, you ain't meant to be here. Oh my god, so what, now I have to fucking kill him? I don't think I was supposed to fucking kill him. Leave the construction site. Do I have a fucking parachute? Oh, I don't have a parachute, fuck. Well, I thought I did. Oh, look, it's the great RT. Study him and study him. Where the fuck did this fool get his uh, hard hat? That's 
That's the engineer's plan. Mine you treat like a religious text, remember? Yeah, that's it. This guy! Anyone know this guy? You hey, I don't know you, pal. Pal? I don't want to kill him. Man, running for me is a bad idea. Someone help me! Protect me from him! Get him away! Oh my god, bro. I want to do this mission right. Oh, Plix, yeah, I think Canelo might win, but I can also see Mungia winning. But Mungia might just be in the same position Canelo was when... Mayweather passed to ah uh, you think so you think you think Munguia is really that good to be honest I mean I, I mean I know you right and you obviously you know me I I and I know that you know a lot about boxing so I know you keep up with it I don't keep up with it like that so I mean I'll see oh look it's the great RT study him and study him hard I was gonna wipe my ass on him that's the engineer's plans mine you treat like a religious text remember yeah that's it. This guy! Anyone know this guy? Hey, excuse me. You're not meant to be here. Help! Help! Someone help me! Where is he? Oh, he ran the other way. No! Fuck, bro, I'm... Ugh! Why is this so hard? The great RT. Study him and study him hard. I was gonna wipe my ass on him. That's I mean, he might not be the best boxer right now, but I can see him growing and learning. So far, he's undefeated. Canelo's undefeated in the first loss to me, but that's true. I'm gonna go around. Get the architect to give up his briefcase. Hey! Stop! Man, running for me is a bad idea! Hey, look at you! I'll go this other way. Now you definitely bring up a good point to Oplex. I mean, but that's the thing. Oh my God. I don't not want to do that. But that's the thing about boxing, dude, is like, it sucks because they try to make it seem like after your first loss, you're not really good anymore. <sighs> Bro, did I just fuck up again? <sighs> uh, I saw those highlights. Um, Oplex just said he also did beat Ryder way worse than Canelo did. Mungia actually put him down. Also, Canelo doesn't have many fights left in him. Boxers only fight once a year. That's true. Um, but yeah, I actually saw those highlights, dude. And uh, yeah, he, he was rocking him pretty bad. Go to the garment factory. Oh, so we're getting the blueprints for um, the bank. Maze bank, literally this one right here.
Can I drive under that? Like Fast and the Furious? I doubt it. Oh yeah. I fucking killed that guy. Oh my god, bro, this fucking car sucks at turning. I'm flipping them off. that right now give me a sec nice I'll actually just read it right now Oplex yeah it actually wasn't like that before boxers used to have losses and still consider the best this is actually a new idea all because of Mayweather. He's he's a modern fighter who beat the most champions uh, out of anyone and retired and defeated. So everyone thinks if you're going to be the best, you got to be undefeated because Mayweather was able to do it. That's true. Yeah, Mayweather did change up the game. It's crazy, bro, because like I started watching boxing whenever Mayweather was uh, like barely coming up. Bro, the first boxing fight I've ever seen was Oscar La Hoya and Mayweather. Hey, you got him? Of course I do, homie. Here. Thank you. So, all good? Sure, homie. So is this shit for real? We just gonna rob the FIB and be allowed to walk by your boys like that? Yeah, I don't fucking know. Probably not. Hey, right, Lester, what do you got? Uh, I don't quite know yet. Give me a minute. I'm not a fucking computer. Oh. Oh. Oh, maybe I am. <laughs> Here's what I think. We have two options. The new security <laughs> software goes into containment mode in case of emergency, you know, uh, earthquakes, mudslides, acts of God. So we could plant some firebombs. They go bang, the emergency call goes out. We hijack it, show up as firemen, and then we grab the containment drive. Or we could hack the system on site. We'll go in by, uh, by air. Uh, hope we don't run into too much physical resistance. Sounds relaxing. Either bombing our office ran by a division of corrupt government psychos or defeating one of the world's most complex security systems using our worthless ass ninja skills, huh? Yeah. <laughs> meeny, meeny, miny, mo. If you favor the firebomb containment drive option, you'll go in with that janitor's ID you picked up. It'll be at night when most of the workers are off. You mop the place and plant the bombs where we need them. Seriously? I got a mop? Yeah, yeah, you really do. They'll clock you on the cameras if you're play acting. You also need a fire truck to show up in when the bombs go off, and a getaway car stashed in a quiet place near the bureau so you can torch the truck and get out. The car doesn't have to be anything special. There shouldn't be any heat. Well, what about the other way, with the uh, ninja skills? Now you choose that route, you won't be using the janitor's gear, but we had to cover all the bases. Your FIB paymasters will have to provide you with a chopper and a pilot. Now you fly way up above the building, parachute in, and gain access through the roof here. Now you'll need to be armed to the teeth, mind you, just in case the uh, shit goes down. Mopping or parachuting? Wow, you're making this choice really difficult. Now Haynes has given us the leftover money from the Polito job to pull this mission, and the crew will be paid out of that. We keep the change. So, roof. what's it gonna be? I like action, we're gonna do the roof. Of course. Uh, you'll need a, a hacker, a gunman, and a driver. The hacker won't come in with you, but they'll help you break the system, talking you through the process from a remote location. You need location. a good hacker, then. Mm. Who was the guy that we met at the fucking... At Life Invader? Oh, that's him. I 
Hey, Michael, you're up. Shut up, bitch. Hold up, guys. Um... <clears throat> Mission, Jay Norris. Life hey, what's it gonna be, yeah? Shut your whole ass up. Oplex, trying to make fighter with their fighters. I think this is him, dude. I guess he's really thinking about this one. Yeah, it is this guy. So we'll hire this guy. Ricky, I know he didn't do so good at the jewelry store, but he's probably gotten better, and he's still the same price. I don't know how long it'll take you to get into the network. The gunman's there to buy you the time you need. Who the fuck is Hughes? Well, should be okay. He's got a few scores left in him. The driver will be waiting outside on getaway. They'll source a vehicle, so bear that in mind. Bro, we're gonna get the cheapest ah, guys. I'm gonna fuck. This one's new blood. I've seen him drive, <laughs> but I haven't seen him under pressure. Okay, that all look good to you? You are robbing the FIB here. <sighs> yeah, I need a fat fucking cut. And cup. we have a winner. I'll make the arrangements and call you when we're ready. All right, shit, hit me. You know, um, I'm still looking into that Union Depository gig. It's real interesting. But I don't know if we can do it without you-know-who. Uh, well, as long as he can't do it without us. Okay. And who are we robbing? So this isn't the one for the Union Depository? I thought this was it. <clears throat> I don't give a fuck. Um, Alright guys, so I have a, a, a story time for you guys. A little story time with Dumzo Danino. So, Oplex and I are over here. We're talking about boxing, right? And I had mentioned earlier that my very first boxing fight that I saw <laughs> was with De La Hoya and Mayweather. Um, yeah, so the first boxing fight that I ever watched was uh, De La Hoya versus Mayweather. And um, so, I mean, I know what boxing is. I, I And I knew, like, I've seen it before and all that stuff. I was maybe around, like, I was maybe around, like, mm, like, 10 or 11 years old. So I knew what boxing was. I knew the sport. I knew that. But I've never seen a boxing fight, like, where everybody gets together and watches it. So I remember for that fight, my dad told me, he's like, oh, we're going to go watch a fight at your cousin's house. And keep in mind, my cousins, they already had, like, families and stuff like that. They're, like, at least 10 years older than me. At least. So, <laughs> my dad comes into my room and he tells me, hey, uh, we're going to go watch a, a fight at your cousin's house. Get ready. My dumbass, being a kid, not knowing any better, I legit thought that we were going to go watch my cousin fight some guy at his own house. I don't know why I thought that. I dead ass thought, oh fuck, bro, we're literally gonna go watch my cousin throw, throw hands with some random ass guy at fucking his house and my dad's gonna be there and he's gonna probably fight him. My dumb ass is there like, oh my God, like why are you taking me? I don't wanna go. And, um, but whenever we got there, I was like, oh, we're gonna watch a boxing fight. I was like, dad, you could have just fucking said that. Like, what the fuck? Well, you we were thinking that my cousin was gonna throw down at his own house and we're just gonna go and watch. Like, what the fuck? But yeah, that was the very first fight that I've ever seen and that was my, my experience for it. 
That was a good fucking fight, though, dude. Like, I mean, Oscar de la Hoya back then was a motherfucker. What is it? Money? Drugs? Your mother. There's this guy. He's been following me around. I think he's about to do something. <sighs> yes. Where are what the you? Fuck? Pinewood Plaza. Okay, wait there. He's been following me in my car, so let's just drive around and you can talk to him when he shows. Oh, yeah. We'll talk. Bro, that's his fucking daughter. You can't just say no. What the fuck? I don't even like Tracy. And she's not even my daughter, but I, I mean, those are just my morals. Funny thing is that the first memory I have of my first boxing match, Mayweather and De La Hoya. For real? That's your first one too? Bro, you must have been hella younger though. You were like... Like maybe eight or something? Yeah, there you go. You see? Ah, bro, I was probably older than that. I, don't, I really don't remember, to be quite honest. But it was around, it was around that, that, uh, that age. Do this. We should try over at Hawaiian snow for him. We're looking for a guy in a purple convertible. I don't remember what name. Okay, I'll keep an eye out. Thanks, Daddy. Listen to the right music. Is he here? No, he's not around. We should try that motel opposite the big construction site. What the fuck is this about, dude? So you better not be taking out credit like your brother. Right? Not credit. Oh fuck, that taxi looked like it was floating. Did you see him? I don't think so. Maybe we should look over at Cluck and Bell. Rockford Plaza. I, I was signing autographs. Want to meet you after that video on Fame or Shame? Oh, she probably did a porn. Yeah, oh, well, now you just gotta find a way to make money out of it. <laughs> we found this prick? Not yet. Okay, uh, how about going around the corner and back up the hill past Crocahoo? Bro, oh, this is fucking a waste of time. Very own stuff. You finally made it, Dad. You raise your kids in Rockford Hills. Ah, purple car, that's him. Fuck, he's on you. Let's go. Who is this guy? Hey, what are you running for, pal? Let's talk. Holy shit! What? We got fucked up there. Oh my god. There's a grown man in the car. I swear he... <laughs> He's out of the car! I get it. I'm going. I'll never come back. I'm an addict. I need help. I'm the victim. Got him. Bro, I just shot him in the fucking leg. I need, to, I need to get him with the fucking stun gun. I don't want to shoot him anymore. Kill me for loving her. That ain't love. It's the internet. You're a cyber creep. You're right. You're right. I'm getting help. Don't kill me. Bro, this guy has to get tired at least at one point. I just want to get him with this. Bastard. All the way out of town. I'll leave the state. I promise. I'm going to Thailand. I mean rehab. Bro, this dude can I'm fucking gone. run. Ah! I need to fucking shoot him again. A... Fuck, now I have the cops. Bro, that didn't do shit. She'll never see me again. No! 
Alright, that's I think I got enough right there. I could probably stun him right here. Damn! Leave me alone. Bro, just stay down! Go back to Tracy's car, bro. I fucking lost that bitch. Um, Oplex. There was a lot of beef in that fight. Mayweather's dad was mad at Mayweather. So he... Oh, that's right, dude. Oh, they always had a bunch of stupid ass beef, though. Oh my god. I should not have done that. Uh, Mayweather's dad was mad at Mayweather, so he trained Aloy and beat his own son. Yeah, that's just dumb as fuck. Yeah, so I'm assuming that fucking this bitch has a porn video and somebody's all obsessed over her. That's a sick ass car though. What happened, Daddy? Guy had an accident. I'm sorry. Alright guys, number two. This one's the lemon flavor. I don't like the lemon. I can't believe you did that. But this one's good. What? We had to be sure. I just wanted you to speak to him. This was infinitely more persuasive. He never should have called you. What the fuck? There's a lot of sickos out there. I couldn't take the chance. I know there are sickos out there. My dad is one of them. Grow up, baby. It's time you got serious with your life. Yeah, I ain't perfect, but I love you. I guess he really scared me, but I, I didn't know what. Well, then pretend it never happened. Like I try not to think about exactly what aspect of your creative expression enamored him so much. For real. Okay. That's right. Denial kind of works for me. Good. That's my girl. Now, please, try to make better choices. Millennial issues as a co-host. Thanks, Daddy. <laughs> Bye. I'm glad I could use my paternal rage productively for once. Left thinking progressive entertainment talk show for all of Los Santos and Blaine County. Oh, you just love saying that, don't you? Yeah, for some reason, I feel like I didn't do the right thing. But... I'm gonna fix that. Alright, that should right all the wrongs. Go get your own car. Damn! We're on. Fuck. Go back to the house. Take that. What's the S? Oh, Solomon. Yeah, let's go do his missions. Damn, this car fucking sucks on turning. Fantastic career for the fan club. That's Ooh, just great. Two clubs. Yeah. These are overrated. 
shit to get you on my show. Maybe you could come on and sing with me like a duet. Man, it's so great that you're doing something more meaningful. Jimbo, you know, we could grab a drink sometime. <laughs> uh, Oplex. Yeah, Mayweather is actually a junior. Good yeah, that's true. Slick. That is true. Devin. And he told his dad, I ain't no junior. <laughs> It's over, Michael. You done good, kid. You kept this bullshit up long enough to help me trigger a fantastic insurance payout when the plug is pulled. I love you. You're you're like my spirit brother now. Where's Solomon? He's out getting the negatives of film, whatever the fuck it is. The last dinosaur in town is about to get fossilized. What are you talking about? Look, the movie's nearly done, so if the plug's pulled now, the investors, meaning us, get a massive insurance payout. Meanwhile, I can use that to get the other major shareholder, the old bastard. Oh my god, you're a dipshit. To agree I to think tear I know what he's doing. Down and let me redevelop the area for condos. <laughs> In this economy, the city's gonna let me build tax free. I might even get some rebates. It is a brilliant thing, and it is all thanks to you and Molly's eye for the details of the insurance policy. Michael, they're fucking us! The suits! And they don't even wear suits! Wolves in turds clothing! Try not to take it too badly, Mr. Richards. Were you ever a human being? Look, people used to like films, now they like what? Videoing themselves, beating off on their iFruit phones. Don't blame me. I'm a very spiritual person. I feel badly about this. But evolution is evolution. I hope we get to clap that guy. Molly. Fuck that guy. Namaste. Here's a piece of shit. Can I take the film now, Mr. Richards? No. My plane leaves in 25 minutes. Can't we do something? At least let me finish the picture, then close the place down. I'm afraid our timetable doesn't allow for that. Goodbye, Mr. Richards. Where the hell is she going with that movie? She is taking the only copy offshore, somewhere nice and discreet. Analog! God, it's certainly got its complications. Michael, can you do something? No, he can't do anything, pal. I'll it's still do it. Ability. Oh, fuck. <sighs> My wife got screwed by a yogi. And now I'm getting screwed by a yogi? Fuck that! I'm a producer! Nobody fucks with my film! There you go. Let's do this. Okay, okay. The airport. Let's get a fast ass fucking car. Where did the airport find Molly? Shut the fuck up. Hey, I'm a producer. I'm producing the goods. Don't do this, Slick. Think. She's got a police escort. I She's don't on the way to my care. personal hangar. Security at the airport work for me. I just want to get the film back before she does anything rash with. Molly's highly strung. She's not going to stop and talk it out with a deranged killer chasing after her. I'm going to keep going. Who I am today. Look, I don't want to hurt anyone. I just want to get my move. Slow down and use your brain. Fun time is over. Yeah, they call the fucking cops. What is she doing? What the fuck? Oh, so she's going crazy too. Nah, come on, drive straight. They fucking got me! Bastard! Oh shit! 
Where is he? Bro, this car's all fucked up. Oh yeah, what the fuck's wrong with her? Come on. Fuck. Bro, there's no way that the jet engine project like like air whatever it's called projectiles if that's even the right word for it there's no way that shit pushes cars i don't believe that you're playing chicken Finally, bro, we get rid of her. Shut up. I think you need some help right now. Out of my way! Oh, bro, she need fucked up. Thank God. Fuck no, you guys didn't, you didn't see anything. They're gonna blame it on me. That guy didn't see anything. Ah, that was nasty and needless. Ah, lose the cops, man. Fuck. Oh, look at her fucking guts. Take the plane, take the plane, take the plane. Oh, hell yeah. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Speed up, speed up, speed up. Let's do this. Move. Uh, Oplex says his uncle, Roger Mayweather, was Mayweather's lifelong trainer. His uncle and his dad were both famous boxers, especially his uncle. His uncle was nicknamed the Mexican Killer. So Julio says that Chavez fought him and beat the hell out of him. Roger Mayweather actually quit. On his stool and told him to get up and he nodded no fuck send me those fights bro that's crazy all right i'm gonna wait for the cops first Come on. Get some speed, get some speed. How fast am I going? I don't even know how to read these. Oh shit, pull up. Now, how the fuck do I get off of this? <clears throat> I could probably land right here. <laughs> or not. Got a fucking full comp from somebody, though. Hopefully, they call me back. <laughs> I love you. 
loved you once, Tony, but there's nothing between us. Now that I know you prefer dictation. Really? We're doing this now? I just watched Devin Weston's legal counsel get juiced in a jet engine. Oh, that Molly woman? Oh, Lord, that's horrible. You have no idea. She panicked, went crazy, and ran into it. But I saved the print, so we still got our movie. You believe that analog thing? It's all it was a fake. We have backups everywhere. Oh my I god, mean, oh man. Green screen. Well, you could have told me. I'm sorry. Look, I thought you knew. The edit's nearly done, and we've got to get it out before they can screw us again. I've greenlit a premiere. That will stop them from burying us. A premiere? For Meltdown? Okay. Can you invite my family? They can finally have something to be proud of me for. Of course! It's already on its way by courier. All right. Shit. I'll get ready. It was an American divorce, by the way. Oh, oh Lord! <laughs> Alright, that car's mine. Oh, God! <laughs> what time is it? Call Solomon back. Does um Franklin have? I don't think he has anything. I think we have to um do I mean, the heist. I'm drunk, but see, I ain't getting drunker. <sighs> well, that's a nice car. Actually, they're not that far from each other. Alright, let's see where Franklin's at. No! Fucking Franklin, man. There's an exit right here. Fuck. I'm about to pick up Franklin. Where is he? Oh, he's right fucking there. They start to get older and chunkier and have that weird fat girl smell. You appear in commercial. Other way, dumbass. He's right there. I can see his car. Look at him, he's all drunk. What are you doing, Franklin? Franklin! We're bumping into you like this, Mike. So, you want to grab a drink or something? Aren't you already drunk? Why the hell not? What the fuck? Your life invader friends start to go down. The private members' clubs tell you that you're no longer welcome because you try to speak to a movie store. They won't have So? So what? Oh, what's that golden thing? That's a movie? What now? Just let me go do the heist. Don't get involved, kid. It seems like I'm already involved. Well, then you're dead too. 
Trevor? Your producer calls made up some He ain't right. I mean, we're not right, but he's really not right. You know what I'm saying? Man, I'm not sure I do. Well, I suggest you learn then and learn <laughs> fast. Otherwise, he'll eat you. And I don't necessarily mean that metaphorically. He thinks you will eat me. No doubt. But ask yourself why I did what I did. Was it so bad? Did I really have a choice? You ask yourself that before you make any moral judgments on me. Hey, uh, yeah, there's something I should probably handle over here. Bro, he's a part of it too, dumbass. You know I'll leave you to it, man. He's a part of it too, Michael, you fucking idiot. Ah, hello, my friend. Hey, what are you looking so cool, calm, and collected for? I guess because I'm not the one who's about to die based on some inappropriate decision I made a long time ago. Ah, <sighs> thanks for the moral support. I appreciate it. What the fuck ever happened to Barry in the past, huh? Any fool should be able to turn over a new leaf, right? Well, first, your new leaves aren't so very different from your previous leaves. Seems like they fell from a pretty similar tree. Second, the age of the internet, my ludite friend. Is he burning down the whole thing? Arno. Everything you do and don't do is recorded forever and used to beat you. This is the age of Judgment Day every day. And in the revelation of that, I'd say that you got off pretty lightly. What with all the, uh, the murders and the, and, and the thefts and... All right. This straight talking new, uh, tell it like it is reality guy act. Uh -huh. It ain't working so well for me. <laughs> in that case, um... Don't worry about it. Everything is fine. You're a good man and a great father, really. It's more like it. Hey, what's up, y'all? Hey. So what y'all talking about? The internet age. <laughs> the internet age? Oh, yeah. Man, ain't we got a highly defended federal building to fucking rob? Yes, we do. Let's get after it. I'm gonna miss this place. If we're gonna do this thing and maybe take that score, well, I, I guess this has all gotta be gone. <laughs> All right, with the sad goodbyes. Oh, fuck, Michael. Yeah, that's... You're definitely not gonna like this place. Or remember it. Agent Stevie cleared the noose building in Palomino Highlands as a base for this op. All right, now let's roll on this thing. Why are you so chipper? Shit, why are you so miserable? Must be an age thing. Great. Now there's something to look forward to. What's the plan again, man? And please, let it involve someone shooting you for being so goddamn miserable. Oh, what is this? Pick on me day? Look, I know I'm a miserable old prick, but give me a break. You and Lester. Shit. So the plan was feeling sorry for your ass, right? I miss Lester saying that shit, for sure. Let's feel sorry for Michael. Rich, white Michael, poor Michael, who robbed banks for 10 years, then got his slate wiped clean. Yeah, yeah. <coughs> poor Michaels, whose homies get in the shit with the FIB out of the kindness of their own heart. Put their necks on the line. Man, where's my get out of jail free car, motherfucker? I'm sorry, okay? You know what, Mike? You're a real easy dude to identify with, man. Poor me. Poor me. Man, pour me a drink, nigga. Okay. <laughs> okay. I can see. Bruh. Maybe oh. I've been a little caught up in myself. A little? Man, just give me the plan, okay? All right. Here's the shot. We're taking a chopper up to altitude, jumping out, and climbing in through the Bureau skylight. We hit the computer system. That might take a while, so we gotta hold off any resistance. Once we're in the system, we download the files, chopper picks us up. Hey, that was real simple, wasn't it? I'm informed now, dog. So you wanna wallow in some more of your self-pity? Get another free therapy session? Actually, now that you mention it. Hey, fuck you. The place is up here. Chopper pilot, gunman, driver, and hacker should be waiting. I'll radio in. Guys, you there? He's on time, bro. You got a professional setup here. Chopper's ready to go. Okay, I need my engineer stationed outside the building calling in updates. On it, bro. I'll get over there. Hey, here we go, man. This is on. Bro, why are these guys in with it? 
Like, who the fuck is that? That's the Clemson vibration gene that sh- Oh, wait, because I'm working Ain't with the FIB. Guy? No shit. You gonna take us to your chopper? If you wanna pilot the first leg, I'll take over once you jump. Shut up, bitch. All right, here we go, guys. I'm gonna take us up to the jump spot. Feels weird not having Trevor on the stick. Dead ass. Okay to me. He might be a better pilot, but I'm less inclined to kill you in your sleep. See, that ain't what he says. Okay, I'm less inclined to stab you in the face and then do funny things to your corpse. That sounds about right. Hey, everyone, quick pep talk. My friend Franklin here called me out for being an ungrateful prick on the way over here. I have to admit, I've been remiss. Everyone's being paid on this run except me, but it ain't great money for the crazy target you're drawing on your back, and there's a good chance this thing won't work at all. Bro, low key, uh, this map's not that big time. either. So in short, thank I don't you know. For your I kind of want to look back at the definitive edition for San Andreas. So take something from that if you will. There'll be more scores down the road. Maybe a big one. And sunnier days ahead. But this is where we are right now. So let's try to survive it and achieve our objectives. We stick together, we might not die. That's what's getting me through this. Hey, come on. Grab the stick. You got it. Ready? Are you? You fucking kidding me? I'm lucky I can even breathe at this altitude. Let alone calculate the odds of surviving the jump, landing, fucking firefighter, whatever else blowback there might be. Alright! Shouldn't have end. Let's go! Come on! What are you fucking waiting for? We are! You going or what? Whoa! Alright, Michael. That's how you do it. Oh no, I'm probably fucked up. Nah, I'm fine. Fuck, they're already there? Well, I mean, true, I just went shh, fucking nosedive. All right, Michael, don't fuck this up. LB and RB to slow descent. Fuck that, we're just going straight in. Get in there. There you go. Okay. Come on, Franklin, let's go, buddy. You got it. Great. <laughs> Better than an elevator. Ah, ah, fuck. We're in. I'm getting the hang of this heist work. Server rooms in the bottom right of my plans here. It's locked. It's locked. I'm setting a charge. Take the gun. Man, you really bring that piece to a raid on the federal building? What was I supposed to bring? You're freaking me out when we got to get ready for the guards. Bro, but that's such a loud noise. Yep, that's what I was going to say. All right, get in there, Michael. Yeah, no shit. An explosion will tend to do that. I'm looking at the terminal. The terminal, my bad. Connector cell apps are on there. They better be. Yeah, I done did my homework this time. Access my computer. Now let's get some linkage. Give me hat connect in this bitch. This little puppy is gonna locate your IP address in the network output. Uh. Now let me school you. Your IP is a number. That number at the top. You're looking for it in the numbers in the middle. 
Well, no, I'm fucking drunk though. Okay, 93, 93, 93, 93, 93, 93. Ah, uh, there it is. Fuck, I just lost it. This is like way, way above my skill level. Okay, right, now what? I'm connected. Then you are ready to bring down a firewall. Brute force, bitches. Boot it up. Fuck, okay, what do I do now? tries lots of different passwords and picks off a letter at a time. I think... I think I'm in. Now start down and out and let me go to work. Okay, people, we're rewriting history. Looks like security is right on top of you. Hear that? We gotta hold them up or this thing completes its process. Hey, we will prepare for this. Let's take it. I'm sticking here. Starting the file transfer. That's fine. <clears throat> I can do this on my own. It's underway. We need that chopper ASAP. Get her over the building. Hey, just coming from the left. Get out of here. The room on the left. They're coming. Here's our lift. The network ain't down yet. Oh, poor guy. Now that guy's fucked. This escalated quickly. Change of plan. Use the backup gear. Make our way down the building. Repel off the side. Shit! They're gassing us out! Smoke bomb! Be cool! Serious bad luck, bros. What? Dude, that chopper crash ripped the ass out of the building. A couple of floors, man. Devastation. Great. Ah, thanks. Hold tight! Hold tight! Hey, you're good to go, man. Grab it! About time! Got it. All right, people. Let's get the hell out of here. Let's get the FIB building. Hopefully it's fucking easy. Oh shit, I shot Franklin! <laughs> He's gonna die. I just iced the guy. There you go. Hold on, I hear something in the stairwell. Okay, I'm opening it. Shoot, move! Shoot and move! Let's go! Hey, we got a problem up here. Sprinkler system. Can't see anything. Man, can I help? Don't beat yourself up. Just be better next time, okay? And tell us if anything bad comes over the airways. Where's that guy at? We're coming through! We getting out of here! That's why I slowed it down. Because I had a feeling I was like, bro, this was going to pop up and he's going to kill me. Fucking bitch. Ugh. Let's go with Franklin, man. Oh, wait, no, they both have the same amount of health. <clears throat> Coming through! On your. Guns are live! I'm freaking out! Easy. We gotta go! Shut up. I can handle this door. Oh, I just iced the guy. <laughs> Shut the fuck out, Mike. What are you doing? Okay, I'm opening it. 
System. Can't see any. Oh, man, can I have to shut it off? Oh, Don't beat yourself up. Just be better next time, okay? And tell us if anything bad comes over the airways. Let's move. Oh, that's the fire from the helicopter crash. Poor guy. He didn't make it. Sure, man, because he might be. Nah, he didn't make it. No, he didn't make it. Are you funny, huh, motherfucker? Well, let's get the fuck out of here. No, we're too high. The wind will tie us in a knot. We gotta keep moving. Come on, let's go. Hey. Oh. Ah! Bro, I'll just jump off already. Shotgun. Push, people! Oh my god, my lungs! Fuck you. Get me out of this place! I need Stay with me! Reload, Michael. Reload, reload. <sighs> Go cast your pension! Always move it! Let's go! Let's go. Oh. This way! Stoolies! Ah. We have a man down! Shoot, move! Shoot and move! I can't take much more of this! Let's go! You the point man, dog, so come out! Ah. Oh. Keep going! Hey, this could be our way out. We low enough? Yeah, this will do. Set up the rigs. All right, come on. What's going on on the outside? To, to be honest, the government's taking this kind of badly, like getting emotional. They got mad dudes arriving in all our own and Tito. Well, then we better get gone before they show up. Let's get the fuck out of here, then. Okay, let's blow this joint. Over to the right, dog. Man, it's about every cop in L.S. County on the way. It don't look like they're for us. Not yet, at least. Oh, my God. Crap, they got a bird. Go. Holy shit. Hi, dumbasses. We gotta take out that chopper. He's dead. I killed the fucking dude. We're coming through. I didn't think the FIB had shit like that. I literally killed the fucking driver. Oh, I guess he's still alive then. Doing, Michael. Get out of here. He's not dead. This is self defense, right? Back down, assholes. It's them or us. Out of the way. I wish we had that helicopter. See the drive. Kareem, come in. Uh, hey, you're not at the pickup spot. Yeah, no shit, man. Cops have the whole block locked down. It's gonna be another few minutes. Cut 
great asshole. If it's any longer than that, we're gonna have words. Look out, news team! We got it should be easy. Till the driver makes it. Let me guess, this driver came cheap, huh? Yeah, he was only supposed to be a backup. If the chopper hadn't the crashed, we wouldn't have needed him. I'm your ride. Get in here. Oh, I'm just fucking shooting at him. Come on, Dumbzo. Gonzo. I brought the van. You're driving it. Play some music, dude. Come on. Fuck, dude. I don't know how the fuck I'm gonna do it. The pain spray over there. If that chopper hadn't crashed, I wouldn't even need to be here. Oh my god. These guys are gonna fucking get me. Oh my god, what are you guys doing on this side? Just keep fucking spawning on this side. Heat him up. I gotta leave. Dude, they just keep coming. What is this? You guys are gonna make it clear that I didn't do any. Hughes Welsh died. Fuck that guy. That's more money for us. As long as the helicopter doesn't get in our tail, we're fine. Fuck out of my way. Oh, there's a helicopter. When I got told I was the backup escape plan, I didn't think it was gonna get this heavy. Damn. Perfect. 
Never mind. Hey, you don't want to follow us too close. Get out. I literally can't fucking get out. There you go. Ugh. Come on. So, yeah, it might be easier to be right here. Fuck, they got me. I still want to keep this, though. Yeah, good luck getting in here. You know what? Actually, actually. Actually, let's see how this pans out. It, it, it took me quite a bit to get in there. We'll see how fucking good they do. The oh, I, I fucking I had two beers, guys. Hey, give me another beer, bitch. Oh, shit. All right, they got in. Never mind. Oh, no. I'm getting fucking mauled. Can they? But how do I get out? Heat up. I thought that was going to work, but apparently it didn't. Just bring down that fucking helicopter, man. Hey, you don't want to follow us too close. We can lose him, right? Bro, it's because it's that fucking helicopter, right? The helicopter left, right? So it should be easier now. Ah, uh, this is getting annoying. So I have an idea, but it's like, it, it requires a lot of like, like, okay, you guys, like, I need to fucking get to it right away. So there's two helicopters. And 
and there's no cops. You see? Just like that. Boom. But I know I'm gonna get him back. Or get in there, get in there, get in there! Come on, Ugh, you fucking... There you go. That's all you had to do. I gotta start hauling ass. Fuck, dude. All right, no, 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 no. I'm still lost. No, no, no. Fuck. We'll do some hard time if they catch us. Bro, literally everywhere there's these fucking cops. Fuck yeah, I need to get on the highway and just get some speed. If that chopper hadn't crashed, I wouldn't even need to be here. Oh, thank God, thank God, thank fucking God. Um... Ugh, the next plane spree is hella far, though. We're gonna get him back. Nope. Never mind. We're in Franklin's hood now. All right, all right, we're clear. Frank, I told Les we could use your place for a post mortem. That's a long ass fucking drive. If you're ever late for a pickup again, I'm gonna leave your ass for the cops, okay? I hope you get that. Well, now we're clear, I can probably say I never expected to make it out of there. Yeah, sure, man. We had it covered. Oh, really? This is it's covered, sure. was it? Uh, yeah. Lester had the plan. It was all set up. Yeah, we had a plan. Hold off the nastiest team of crooked FIB agents in the country while the last of the baby boomers pretends he's a hacker? Come on. It was hopeful. And then when the chopper crashed? Oh, man. I thought there was no fucking way. Why do you think Lester burned down the business? Hell, why do you think I'm doing it for nothing? And these clowns are getting paid? I got a lifestyle to maintain. Cars, holidays, my watch collection, hormones. So what if my cell phone tells the time? Having a cell phone ain't the same as wearing 12 grand on your wrist. You can't begrudge me my passion. It wasn't my intention to begrudge you anything, pal. That said, I see you spending this money in a way that the authorities will notice. You're gonna wake up one morning with a gun in your mouth. Uh, um, okay. Of course. Hey, man, tell him you messing with him, Mike. Hey, I was semi-sorta of serious, but joking once you reacted like that, all right? Chill out. Look, man, he was just messing with y'all. This is great sense of humor. The FIB people who put us up to this, they probably gonna pop him anyway to clean up loose ends. And if they don't, <laughs> he got a homeboy named Trevor that probably will. That's a good point. I ain't gonna have the time to spend it, so enjoy. Ah, uh, yeah, cool. We can joke about how screwed up your damn life is. <laughs> yeah, well, what else are we gonna do? 
Besides, Trevor ain't a problem, and Dave will look after me, I think. I need every penny I can get. Kareem, Frank's place is up here. You think you can dispose of the vehicle and drop him somewhere? <laughs> I think I can manage that. Bro, what are the neighbors gonna say? It's like, what time is it? Seven in the morning? The fucking neighbors just on a fucking Tuesday? They're like these dudes coming in with ski mask and full suits. Like what the fuck? This place too. Hey, you did it! We did. I gotta pee though, guys. I'll be back. Hey, where's my liquor at, dog? I got it. It's right here. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. Here it is. Here it is. There you go. Man, you may be a conflicting, hypocritical, self-loafing old bastard, dog, but there's no one else I'd rather rob a federal building with. Me. Amen <laughs> to that. Thank you, boys. Cheers. 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 <laughs> <sighs> so, you want another drink? I think I better stay at least a little bit sober. I got to deal with Davy and Dickwad yet. Put things to bed. Man, you want me to roll with you, dog? No, no, I'd probably better do this alone. I mean, we did everything. We're all in this together, right? So as long as we all are not together, there's nothing they can really do to us. All right, see you, dog. Take care. Then it's Trevor and I'm out. Oh, we're gonna need Trevor. Maybe you should give him a call now. Oh, fuck that. After I take care of this shit. All right, all right, well, take care of yourself. Frankie! Lester! Lester needs a drink! Is that? Fuck, it's hot in here. Oh, fuck, guys, I've been holding that fucking piss for a minute. What's up, Davey? We hit the bureau for you, Dave. I'm done. Yes, I saw that. Meet me at the court center and I'll debrief you. I'm out, Davey. From now on, done. I appreciate that. I'm trying my best for you, but, but you and Trevor attacking Merriweather? Repeatedly, it doesn't help. That's Trevor's thing. Whoever's thing it is, it's unauthorized and it's dumb. They've been sniffing around my office. We really need to talk. Really? <sighs> all right, all right. I'll come to the court center. Fuck. Fucking Trevor. Even more reason to kill his ass. Oh, let's shit. go now. Bro, they're gonna fucking hit that dog. Or that cat or whatever that shit was. Kill his wife real quick? What the fuck? Where did that car come from? Just ditch the car. Run, 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 run. run. What's up, bitches? I have to read about the oh, Stay down. Uh, I got the cops again. Oh, oh you guys got cars. Who's that bitch at? Oh! Is 
a red dot over there. I wonder what's that about. All of you guys dead. Oh, that's that bike crew, the lost. Nah, she's dead too, I don't care. Yeah, bitch, it's not every day that you see that and you just stand there. I was about to jump out of the fucking car. He does not like to Probably would have died if I did that. Good thing I didn't. Oh, is this the Davy? Is it? Oh, it is. Fuck! I wish I would have done this mission right. Is it? I think it is, guys. Fuck. All right, we're not gonna know until I get there. Where am I? Davy! Oh no, this isn't it. Davy! Uh, see? Davy, that's why we're such great friends, huh? So we're old school. We like old fashioned things, like newspapers, celluloid. Good guys, bad guys. We're friends? Well, I don't know. You tell me. We did what you said, right? Got those people off your back? Now you're gonna do like you said and cut me loose, right? Things are not going to work out quite that way. There's a bit of a problem. That's right, Davy boy. You can say that. Oh Steve, I told you I would handle oh, this. Oh, because you've handled everything so fucking well so far, haven't you? All right, I admit things have been a little unorthodox, I'm but... I'm fucking orthodox! You've ruined my career. Agent Sanchez, arrest these men, both oh, of them. Steve, oh, Steve, whoa! On, please. You fucking kidding me? Arrest me for what? For multiple counts of every fucking crime under the fucking sun. Oh, well, then let me rephrase. Why? Why? Because, because you don't want me to testify in court about our various business dealings, right? Agent Sanchez, apprehend the suspect! Agent Sanchez, you'll do no such thing. Now, Steve, we agreed to speak to Michael, to try and explain things to him. Not this. This causes problems for us all. Okay, okay. Then put your gun down and we'll talk. After you, buddy. Come on, where's the trust? You can do better than that. They know or think they know that I'm the one that was behind the incident. Uh-huh. And now you want me to clean up your mess again, right? Before I end up at the bottom of the ocean. Fucking good luck with that. You're gonna try to kill Michael down, regardless. Boys. Fun time is over. We've got you. Anti-American activity. Put your weapons down, all of you. Oh my God. Who the fuck are you with? With me. You fucking rat. I knew you didn't have the balls for this. For the record, I'm a patriot. I love my country. Put the weapons down. 
Fuck you! We all know you agency boys are ball deep in a plot to drive up your funding by any means necessary. Boys with a gun, down, gentlemen. Who the fuck are they? Fucking Merriweather! What are they doing here? Steve, put your gun down. Oh, same goddamn leg! Oh my god. Fuck! Bullshit. Well, thank God I have more guns. And watch this, guys. Where's that helicopter at? Okay, well, that fucking helicopter is done. But anywhere, Davy, until some more of these guys kill each other. Damn, you have some fucking horrible aim. Bro, Michael single handedly just killing all of them. He get caught in the crossfire? Just jump. <laughs> and I tried. Trevor, you son of a bitch. This is uh this is why it makes it so hard to finish the last the mission, fuck? man. Hey! If anyone's gonna kill you, old friend! It's gonna be me! Oh! You here to finish the job, T? No, 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 no. I'm just here for the opportunity. Now run! The guy who iced Brad and would ice me? I'd be better off putting my sights on him. Hanks made it out of here, and there's another group of agents looking at our shit. Right now, you're not in the position to let our only friend in the bureau get killed. It looks like there's a window. D, run for that stone bench by the pool. I'll come join you. Get rid of that fucking that helicopter. If Uncle T wasn't here, you'd be in real trouble. Look out, a chopper's about to fall on your head. So tell me, TV, who are these bureau men trying to kill me? They're a corrupt division. Gone rogue or on the IAA payroll. I thought you were the corrupt division. Check out the court center. Oh, Merriweather guys, across the walkway from me. What happens to Haynes? Norton gonna pop him at the water cooler on Monday? I'm not popping Steve. Jesus. I'll get close to him and I'll try to control him. That's how we get out of here alive. Shit, 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 shit. What are Merriweather doing at this party? You tell me. For real, dude. Just trying to earn a dime. Well, your dime put us on their radar, and I don't know how we're gonna get off it. The longer you take, the longer I gotta wait to kill you. Fuck, I'm just over here bodying everybody that spawned. Uh, I need Trevor.
Oh, it's a fucking helicopter need to get. Oh my god, Trevor, come on! Trevor! I gotta focus. There you go. What the fuck? There's nobody in that car. Oh yeah, there is. Oh, I think that was uh, that was what's his face. I gotta get out of here. Where am I supposed to go, anyways? have any cops. Might as well just fucking post up right here, no? There's no fucking way! <laughs> There's no way. Alright, hold up. Ah, oh, no way. So conversate. This one's mine. Good luck. Be careful, Davy. Colorado down. Show's over. Proceed to Morningwood. I see what you guys did there. You guys ain't slick.
That had to have been the cleanest landing like ever. At least I don't have to lose the cops. You, don't you know, huh? Yeah, well, maybe it's got a little something to do with being caught in the middle of a three-way firefight between two government agencies and a private militia. You know, it gets me a little stressed out. Okay, but we still need you alive, Mikey boy. I mean, you know, at least for now. Unless, of course, you have another surprise for me. Huh? Maybe something to do with another inappropriate friendship? Yeah, that wasn't exactly Dave's fault. No, no, no. He's just the friendly face of a corrupt government agency looking to further his career by dealing with an equally corrupt and full to the fucking brim with bullshit low rent hood. Listen, Trevor, listen, I've been meaning to. Uh, you know, I've been meaning. I've been meaning to tell you, you know, I've been. <laughs> what have you been meaning to tell me, huh? That you stabbed me in the back, or that you were and always will be a worthless wretch. Who deserves to be put under? Yeah, well, no, what the fuck, fuck did you come back for? Oh, you know why. Ah, oh, no, no, no. <laughs> One last score. Mm hmm. And if it goes good, <laughs> guess what? I don't have to put a little bullet in your head. But <laughs> if it goes bad, well, that's okay, too. Because then you and I get to go to hell. And I get to spend the rest of eternity with you, tormenting you. Well, I guess it's on then. Yeah, I guess it is. Call Lester. Let's go. On speakerphone. Hey, it's me. I know. How'd it go? Just fabulous. Ran into an old friend. Matter of fact, he saved my ass. Oh, we're all friends now. Suppose a group hug's out of the question? <laughs> he wants to, uh, still go on the final victory tour. All right, when it looks like it's a go, I'll contact you. And remember this, gentlemen. If we pull this off, we will be making history. Sorted, nasty, depraved history, but history nonetheless. All right. There. You happy? Fucking thrilled. Don't forget, amigo. Keep my eye on you. Yeah. Yeah. <clears throat> Oh, what is the little bubble? Oh! Yeah, let's go over there. We'll go talk to um the therapist and then we'll call it good. That's one way to make it, right? Well, Michael, I see you're back around and making time for your mental health. Yeah, I don't know why I came. Hmm. What do you want, Michael? I don't know. Bitches! Just, That's what we want. I just Some fucking want, bitches. I want something that isn't this. You know, the fuck was that? Two Some things blocks. at once. I mean, I want to be a good dad, love my family, you know, live the dream. But at the same time, I really want the other stuff too. I suppose you haven't really considered the fact that by neglecting your therapy, you've guaranteed these behavioral relapses. No, I hadn't considered that. So, pal, what's the source of conflict this time? Things are kind of on the uptick, Doc. 
There's no greater concern than optimism. <sighs> Where are we now? Ah, uh, it's getting hard to keep track of who wants to kill me at any given moment. <laughs> Trevor still wants to eat my liver, but we're playing nice because we're working a job together. The FIB, they want me dead uh, because I'm no longer useful to them. The investor guy who hooked me up with the studio, he's pissed off because I didn't burn it down for him. But the wife and kids are back under the roof. So, maybe things are okay. Mm-hmm. Well, family is important, Michael. But make sure you want them there for the right reasons. Any other acting out, friend? Tell me. Not really. I mean, you know, I've been working on myself. I just uh, I stole a couple cars. A few. There's nothing serious. <laughs> stole a couple okay. cars? Well, I hope we're not back... Justifying the unjustifiable, my friend. I want to be good, Doc. I really do. But then I get angry. Hmm. Anything else? Anything sexual? Stop asking him about his well, sex Doc. life. And that Fuck. Regard, nothing to report. Not one. Always single. doing that shit. That's great, Michael. It's real progress. See? Treatment works when you try. So, I feel like there's progress in some areas and, you know, none in others. That's incredible stuff. I don't think I've ever heard such a barrage of denial, self-justification, and outright horror. The thing is, Michael, here, can we just get a quick photo together? Cheese. What is this? I really think I can't treat you anymore. The fact the is, I'm in love with you. The fuck he talking okay, about, Okay, well, Doc? that's not true. <laughs> Good. You're learning. Good. What's going on? Nothing. It's just... I think you need a new therapist. And I'm leaving town. I've got a TV show. I'm gonna be famous. I'm gonna be famous! <laughs> think of the fucking tale. All those fucking bitches who called me pubehead. Oh, <laughs> they'll be lining up to suck it now. You got a TV show. You! Uh, best not to think too closely about what I just said. It's not like I'll be using real names or anything. <laughs> I'm really discreet. <laughs> Bye now. Oh, he fucking snitched them. He snitched on them. Stop nope. and think about it. Deep breaths. Calm. Calm. Now nah, we gotta fucking kill his ass. Because he probably, he knows everything. And he's gonna fucking snitch on them. Fuck, no! I gotta do this over again, guys. For real. Can I do it over? I don't wanna let him go. I wanna fucking kill his ass. Ah. I guess he got away. All right, guys, but I'm going to stop it right there because I have some... I haven't fucking ate dinner. I'm going to go get some dinner with uh, some people. Uh, but, yeah, guys, that pretty much does it for this part. Um, tomorrow is uh, the Canelo fight, first and foremost. Uh, so I will be watching that alongside the UFC 301, which is not a big card, but I am going to tune into it. What else do we got tomorrow? Um, I'm going to barbecue it up with some family. Just chill here at the pad. Dude. Yeah. But as far as like the streaming stuff goes, tomorrow I will stream in the morning. Get that over with. Um, yeah, that pretty much does it. All right, guys. So that does it for part number 17 of GTA 5 for the Xbox Series X. Again, this is your fucking boy. And I'll catch you guys at the next one. Remember, like, comment, subscribe. Check out the vlog, check out the podcast, check out my latest parts. Fuck, go check out my library of the games that have already beat. I don't know. Uh, but yeah, guys, until then, peace and fucking chicken grease. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one.